Society has a lot of preconceived notions about strippers. They conjure up images from music videos, film, and television. The money, the partying, the lavish lifestyle. However, if given the opportunity, would a stripper leave that career for a high paying job in corporate America? Could a stripper with enough business aptitude, leadership, and innovation successfully perform in the business world? We interviewed thousands of exotic dancers and narrowed it down to these 12 beautiful women. They will spend the next 30 days living together in our house, subjected to our business assignments. Yeah, I would go into a business with a lot of money. Okay, you're gonna fail in this business. Challenged both mentally and physically to see if they have what it takes to transition from stripping into a high paying corporate job doing everything from managing the day-to-day -day operations of local businesses to creating marketing campaigns for major corporations. Ladies, opportunity has not. What if you were offered the opportunity to dance or take a high-paying corporate job? If I can make the same amount of money without taking my clothes off, I'll take it. I want it. For your first assignment, you're going to be operating a restaurant. What'd you say? You don't need to look at the other choice. This is it, boo. The world is not ready for me. All you have to do is go like this. Pizza, oh, pizza, 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 pizza. Well, it's important that you understand the business aspects of any venture you go into. Interest before taxes, amortization. What the hell did I sign up for? Food cost. I feel like we were just talking about something else. I don't think he dreams big enough. This class is going to move very, very quickly. I can keep up, don't worry. That kind of stuff is a little wah, wah, wah to me. ROI, gross profit, gross margin. It's confusing. <laughs> I was just trying to listen and take notes without spelling something wrong, so later if I looked at it, I wasn't confused. Everybody find your position. <laughs> what are you thinking? If there's guys out there, I'm going to do what I do best. I'm just saying, this t-shirt, your, your boobs look good in it. Hey ladies, one rule we have, because we got kids here, you can't sit down and touch the guests. Okay? Oh, shit. Support your local strippers, and I just don't feel like other people are taking this seriously. And we're living together, cheers, cheers, cheers. doing competitions together. They're all, they're all, they're all. But you know what? There's, this is a competition. We're being put on teams, or we're being forced to work with these people. We've all driven by the strip clubs, and we've often wondered who works in there. Every day I tell myself I'm going to have a better life soon. My parents both lost their jobs due to the, the, the economy, and um, I had to help pick up the slot. I mean, if we were to take an IQ test, I, I think I'd probably win, because I'm really smart. I can go to church, and you know, everything's fine. Nobody looks at me crazy. I can go to the store. They would never know, because I don't carry myself that way. That's not who I am. That's my job. This is for my sons. This is for myself, and this is for me to better my life just so I can get out of dancing. This is your opportunity to get out of dancing and to prove to the world how bright and successful you can be in a corporate environment. I, I was born to lead. No ifs, ands, or buts about that. The way that we are portrayed in society, you know, is that, that we're all dumb. We don't know what we're doing, but it's not like that. Ladies on Team A, one of your teammates will be going home. We now need to begin the individual vote. The woman that is going home is 